Hello everybody, welcome to Carrots Gaming, I'm Rose Gare. Today back at it again with some more in part where I'm playing the amazing mod, Awakening of the Rebellion, with the amazing sub-mod, Awakening of the Independence. Hello? Which one are you again? Oh yeah, these Torque uh, victories. So, this is our CSA campaign. Our objective right now is to take Zygeria. Do we get the ability to- no, it's just only Black Sun. Okay, cool. Um, just gonna throw that as our fleet lead. We only have one fleet right now, unfortunately. I think we're actually building, yeah, we're building a equivalent of a Star Destroyer right now, which is good. What are you? You're a capital ship, right? Admiral's officer, Gosa, commands a Dauntless. Ooh, interesting. And you command a Luger Hulk. Ooh. Cool, cool, cool. We also get the ability to craft liberators. That's that's pretty good. We also do have the ability to create victory ones. That's pretty decent. We're building droid works. Getting some fighters off the line here. So you're effectively interceptor support. Allows for otherwise frail dauntless to hold up the industry fight. So yeah, they're decent. Make the but yeah, they're interceptors, so they're decent. So I'm actually gonna want to build a couple of those. This is more of a heavy fighter kind of deal. I assume decent at taking out a uh, what you call it corvettes and stuff because they're cutting lasers. Let us start getting our ground team, which is fairly decent because all of our troops are tier ones. So. <laughs> That's just pretty decent in its own right. Or tier 2s, I mean, not even tier 1s. We've gone past tier 1s. We're in tier 2 territory. Which is decent. Also, flamethrower troops. That's just awesome. <laughs> okay, get to here. I want my bombers to go over here. Thank you very much. Also, kind of like that we don't have that many territories to deal with. We only have these planets right here. So we don't really need to deal with anybody else. Here, get to here. Building up this fleet pretty decently. You have no complement, if I remember correctly, right? Let's get into here. You have no complement, right? Yeah, no complement. And you get V wings. Okay. And you get IRD squadrons. IRD is cool. Now, I noticed something. Where can I build them exactly? I saw them. I don't remember where. <laughs> okay. Here? Question mark? Yeah, 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 here. Okay. Pause. These things. These are fighters, right? Yeah. Ground fighters bad. So bad perform so badly in atmosphere combat to the many pilots refuse to engage in targets in atmosphere. This led to the Development of the 30 AI and Starfighter to play against atmospheric bounce. Okay. So these are pretty crap, is what I'm getting from this. So we really don't have a decent fighter. Uh, what's it called? What are you? Combat support. Cool, cool. So we don't really have decent ground fighters. At least, not yet. You are heavy weapons. We only have one, so let's. First of all, I want to check you. Mission? Question mark? We have missions? Since when? I mean, I'll take it. Mon Mothma's giving me this mission, apparently. <laughs> um, you are anti-infantry fighting vehicle. You are, I assume, main battle tank. You are tank destroyers. Pretty well-rounded fleet. What are we dealing with here? Zagarian slavers, yeah. Plus a bunch of tier ones. I'm not too terribly worried about this. Let's get this battle started. Alright, let's get this battle started. So I think this one's going to be pretty interesting, given the fact that I have actually... I have fought these guys plenty, but these are all units I have never actually actively used before. So it's going to be an interesting... Kind of. We're gonna save our. Okay. Let's get. 
Oh dear lord, you look like dog crap. Maybe your wings this time in? Um, let's see if bringing in that. Seven. Uh, what do we need? Well, they didn't have any. They're gonna have some tanks. So let's get some main battle tanks online and a juggernaut company. What do you guys look like? Oh, you guys look so cool. Oh my god, you guys look epic. You have riot shields. Where's the one with the- I want to zoom in on one with the riot shield. Oh, that's so cool. What do you get exactly? Frontline infantry takes a defense cover shield can block incoming fire. That is epic. That is legitimately epic. Also, this formation that they come down in is also epic. Is the formations better? <laughs> That's the thing I've noticed too. Formations look way better. Alright, start moving out. All the way this way. Group 3, we're already destroying something's dead. Let's get up here and block the way. This is point defense. I wouldn't want to auto loot trigger that. Hey, group 2, why don't you stay with the infantry to actually give them proper support? Get to up there. Okay. You do switch fletches, swap anti infantry to anti vehicle fletches. Oh. Interesting. So I'm gonna want to do that like main when I'm in the middle of battle type deal. Would be a good time to do that. Move this way. Move out with them. Group three. I actually want you to move this way. See if you can march this way and kind of disrupt them a bit while we continuously march this way. You get stun cannons? That's decent. Weapons wetty? Did you say ready or wetty? <laughs> Okay, I want to take a good screenshot of you, so I'm going to ask you to stop. Hang on, whoa, whoa, pause. What's happening here? What is happening here? Uh, Lieutenant Min? Hey, why don't you deal with that, please? Get actually up here where you're going to be useful. What the fresh hell are they throwing at us? And what is this exactly? What's here that they're getting something from? I don't know. A little weird. Um. Take a quick screenshot of this. And uh, immediately continue moving. Dear god, that was loud. I guess I can't control the volume of Steam taking a screenshot. We are doing exceptionally well here. So well, in fact. Let's march up here. This one dude. They're gonna really save the day. They must be considered a hero unit, question mark? They're gonna just... That was a bit overkill, buddy. <laughs> I want you to actually go here, because this is where the main fighting's happening. I think we made a big mistake doing this. Get over here. Group 3, I think you guys had the right idea.
kind of move out, or I had the right idea. I'm the one who told them to go here. Why am I making it seem like they're, they have the idea to come here? Get over here. Get over to here ASAP. Group three. Focus immediately on this. Not that I think they can defeat it, but still. Focus on this. Douche. Start putting fire into this, please. I wonder how many how much does your beam weapons actually do? Are you guys actually composite beam weapons? Is that what you have? Yeah, beam cannons. What happens if I boost your weapon power? That seems stupid. <laughs> the cost of defense? Yeah, do it. Just for the moment. Just so you can kind of destroy these guys once they pop out of their shells. Hey, what's happening here? Hello? We have things that are occurring. Destroy them. Move out. I actually want you to move out to here. Move out this way. We're holding our ground fairly decently. These troops are not prepared for this kind of... This isn't even really a battle. <laughs> I don't even know if I'm going to go through the effort of editing battle music into this. Destroy this. Definitely pursue this. While we, group two, definitely pursue that. Destroy that dude. I assume you're sort of like a minor infantry unit, like Kyrian or something like that, like a severely minor, like not even minor in the way it usually applies. Minor in the meaning of useless. Alright, well, there's a little bit of lag there, that was weird. Hey, wait, are you guys... Slavers, yeah, okay. I don't really care. Keep moving forward, please. Group 1, keep moving forward, please. Thank you very much. Hey, group 3. Are, did you delete them? They have slightly different colored carrots than we do. Whoa! Demolish this thing, please. We might actually be able to kill this, and I would do it quickly, because we're getting kind of wrecked here. Thank goodness. Immediately start putting fire into this, because we do have infantry coming up. Hey, what's happening here? Maybe don't just sit around and get taken out by bikes. Or just leave it. Just continue going up. Meet them here. Group 2... Go this way, please. Group 3, turn around and demolish that, please. Whoa! Group 3! You actually have a tank that might hurt you here. Though they're backing into you, which is seems like a dumb decision. It seems like you're going to be up destroyed before you can even do anything. Group 2, get up here. Group 1, move up to here. Group 3, begin to move up here, because they seem to be being little boogers about it. And I know somewhere here they have to have a building of sorts. Start dealing with this, please. While we, by we I mean group 1 and group 2, go this way. Group three, demolish that. What is this? I don't understand what it is, but it stuns us and it's no good. Doesn't do any damage to us, thankfully. It seems like they're just barely getting enough. 
hover to not be killed by us. So focus your fire on this, actually. We do not want Rocketeers. Perfect. You're dead. Where did everybody else go? I don't know, but... Group 1. Don't know why you guys are so incredibly slow. Focus on destroying this, please. Hey, group 3. Keep moving forward, please. We have a bombing run whenever we need one. <laughs> I actually want you guys to move out on your own because you are quicker. Your top speed is relatively quicker. Breeze past that. Don't really care. This is what matters. Okay, fall back. Everybody fall back. Which bombers are coming in? Skip rays. I wonder if they have a different bombing animation. I don't actually know. I doubt they do. <laughs> That'd be kind of stupid if they had their, their own bombing animation. It'd be cool, but it's probably just the same bombing animation as everything else. It's not just in perspective of the bombers, that's not it. Coming in. I always love just exchanging fire with them. Are you actual enemies, or you know, you just like some. I don't care about you. What? the hell? Oh. Wait, no, that still doesn't explain it. It's like electrical fountain. And the bombing run is coming in. And... Yep, same bombs. D don't tell me! Are you kidding? You know, I don't even care. Do you know why? Because in like three seconds... You're shooting at your own. In like three seconds, I'm gonna need you guys to come up here, give me a visual. And, Kadoosh. Stay here, shoot at this, yeah sure, do whatever you want. What version of Orbital did we get? The Rebellion's version. Kadoosh. Kadoosh. Okay, start helping him. <laughs> this is obviously gonna take a while. Group 3, start helping him. Hey, you guys are done. You're fighting something. What are you fighting? You sure killed that one dude. These poor, just single people just trying to run and live their life, and they're just getting freaking horrible out of existence. Oh, get there. They're trying to retreat. Don't let them. I don't think they can, so I don't know why they're trying to. I did put that, didn't I? Oh, do you restrict all movement? No. You just have eyes on them, so you don't care. And just kind of obliterate them, please. What did you just shoot over here? How bad aim do you have? <gasps> Why don't you focus on that, please? That's not a great thing. That could actually kill you if you're not careful. Okay, that's dead. I don't even need to do anything else with that. Continue to move forward. I want you guys to move out here in case they attempt to retreat because that would just be really annoying. See where we're going to get any salvage from killing individual troops. They definitely just kind of gave up running, didn't they? <laughs> I mean, I would have too, honestly. Blow them away! And, is this the last person? Please tell me this is the last person, I'm getting bored. 
It wasn't crap. Nope, we're fighting last person. No, we're not. We're fighting something designed to kill us. Why don't you do this, please? I don't know what the hell we just did, but it was epic. So they definitely tried to escape. Don't let them, please. Do you have hunter kill? Yes, you have hunter kill. Hunt him out, please. They are enemies with them. Oh, well, I don't need to do anything. Dunk, 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 dunk. This thing is literally designed at taking these squads and just demolishing the crap out of them. I was about to say, that dude just tanked two grenades. Dear God, that's a beast. All right, get me out of this battle. That was boring. This isn't a slight against the mod, that just happens in Empire or sometimes. You'll just have that one unit just running away constantly, because sometimes they don't attack you as a single force and they spread out. And the reason being was because there were so many Black Sun people on that world that they were enemies with, they were going about around and fighting them as well. We weren't the only enemy they were dealing with. Let's immediately... Taxation. Tax ever laughing crap out of them and get one of these and we have two of these one of these not even close to one of these but you know what would be a good idea to grab one of these before we actually do a full-scale invasion also let's check out our fighter force Kind of crappy, but honestly, better than previously. Building stuff immediately on the ground. Taxation office already? No. I, what did I build first? I mean, I guess I wanted this first anyway, but I could have sworn I built tax somewhere. <laughs> Where did I put tax? Where the hell did I tax? I clicked the tax. People saw me click the tax one, right? I'm not insane. You have planetary defenders, one arc squadron, one panhook squadron. What is a panhook? That's you, right? No. You? No. Interesting. Don't know what you are. Cool. You spy on people for us, please. We're not going to take Telos because that would open us up to Rebellion. I guess we can't take Korriban, can we? Huh. How do we do this? Because at this point, we're facing both Black Sun and Rebellion. Plus, we already have an open airway to Empire, which I did not realize previously. I can only hope that they're preoccupied with everybody else. <laughs> Please immediately get this. God, just buying one station just made us broke. Yeah, we definitely need money. Desperately.
I get here and any day now. Ooh, free Lucky Lou. Don't mind if I do. We could take that. Not that we want to. What are you? Panhook. That's what you are. Swarm fighters. Interesting. What do you have now? Very similar flight to last time, but this will eat up our fighters. Plus these guys, so they're going to actually have fighters. A shockingly well-rounded fleet. They have anti-fighter, fighters, and a good damage dealer. It's not great because it is super small, so they are going to just get trounced on by this fleet. At least I hope that's how it's going to go. <laughs> because we should have enough anti-fighters work on our own just to kind of keep them at bay. And we'll just use our capital ships to shell the crap out of the other ships. Particularly focusing on the neutron star bulks so that we can send in our fighters to wipe up the Mandalorian dungeon? Lictor dungeon ship? The grand battle is going to be interesting because they have droidicas and pike elite soldier troops. Interesting. Anyway, let's get this battle started. Let's get this battle started. Okay, so we don't actually... The map. I don't think I've ever seen this map before. Fascinating. Do that thing, quickly. And we're gonna get up to here. To a free area, and we're gonna immediately just start dropping in capital ships. Like, right here. Drop in. Pick a capital. Thank God. I thought I'd messed up and I put you too close to- I did. You just took damage. That's an issue that I won't make next time. Do this. Um, we're gonna have a picket ship come out here. One of you guys come up here. This. We're not gonna actually bring in any of our fighters just because I don't want to pay for anything. Let's get this little battle group here. Um, start moving out. Start moving out. Start moving out. I'll let you auto do that. Same with you, because you'll auto do it with the ticket with and stuff actually happens. It needs you to do it. This is a decent bet. This is going to be an awesome one for screenshots. Oh dear lord. I did a bad. I accidentally grabbed the border of the screen. Stop moving. Taking a couple of screenshots because I don't care because nothing can destroy us right now. Except if you're an continue to be an idiot, stop moving. Dear Lord, stop it. Okay, pause. Let's get the cheap ass fighters. The V Wings and you to be together. And go and attack this thing that's coming after us right now. Heavier fighters? Which include you, group two. I don't know, start going after this thing. You start dealing with this. Same with you. Start putting rounds into this. Same with you. And actually give us a boost. Dear lord, just look at the missiles. That should be torn apart relatively quickly, same as you. You're actually taking a decent amount of damage for being a literal picket ship. So why don't we get this up here with you to help? 
I guess that's not really your job, but still. Ooh, group two. I found you a nice target. Demolish this, please. Also, destroy this. And this is kind of your whole shtick, isn't it? Oh, that does. That just tore through them. That was highly effective. Also, still love this ship. Let's look at this from the perspective of something like this. Because that just seems kind of cool. Just literal explosions happening everywhere. Okay, cool. Let's see if we can get any cool screenshots through this. We do have several Star Destroyers in the thing, and usually there's some cool Star Destroyer shots. Oh, we just watched that fire get demolished. Anyway, let us focus now on the battle at hand. Where you, which are taking damage and need to stop. Start bombarding the actual crap out of this. Same with you. You start doing that. Give us a nice boost of firepower. And kadoosh, kadoosh, kadoosh. Why don't you start dealing with this, please? And we have another round of fighters, so let us immediately launch those into the fray. Because we're kind of getting swamped here. Especially you, which is about to die. Thank you for not doing any of that. Come up, you. You need to start dealing with this, too. Broadside this, because you are technically a brawler. Yeah, you're a picket brawler. This is kind of what you're good at. Start just going on ham. You start moving out too, start putting rounds into this if you can. And... Question mark, you have tractor beam? That's cool. You also have full salvo. Use it. We are victorious. See, that was a way quicker battle, and in my opinion, way funner. Fighting in space with all these mixture of units is incredibly cool. Because <laughs> you're fighting with basically Imperial and... CIS units, plus Old Republic if you count the Venator and the Invincible. That's just such a cool concept. <laughs> Playing as a C CSA is really fun. <laughs> Alright, I think I'm gonna leave that one here. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this kind of content, please like and subscribe. If you want to see more content, similar to mine, go check out my brother's channel and my cousin's channel. All links will be in the description below. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye bye!